oh, I'm doing an unboxing video. Just got this one from Japan, literally. I'm excited. So I like to do a lot of eBay finds. And here's another one. Let's open this. Got my sidekick right here. <laughs> so I like how they packaged it. That's one good thing about eBay. And this gun, I wanna say I won in a bid. Let me double check how much. So yep, my sidekick sells me trying to open it. So I won this bid for about $80 to $90. Um, I forgot, I want to say they cover shipping. So that's why I always tell people, don't be afraid to negotiate with people when it comes to prices. You know, that's why I like these eBay finds kind of show you that you can get good guns or more high quality guns for cheaper than buying a new gun. I mean, I'm not saying not knocking getting new guns. I'm just more or less, oh, I'm gonna have to fight this. One handing stuff. <laughs> There it is. Ooh, that's pretty. And this is a used one. So I got a gravity side beam. I understand a lot of people in the US don't use this, but the idea is being open to trying new things. At the same time, I mean, it's an SI water. How can you not love it? I mean, literally look at it. it even has a tulip tip. See, even side a nest please ignore my phone okay so this is a used one not bad shape lph 101 so it's just like the lph um 400s just a side filter 101s they have the w 101s the lph 101s i'll be showing you later a lph 101 they come in gravity suction pressure but there's two different types of gravities there's the normal style up top, I wouldn't say normal style. So actually it's just the style that we're more used to in the US, cause I never seen anyone use this in the booth. Maybe with restoration shops, but yeah. So I got this online, uh, $80 for a bid. So again, this is the reason why I say don't be afraid to get used guns. You got a little bit right here, but that's natural. I mean, it's used. And then you have the cap. The cap reminds me of the size of a LPH 300. So I'm gonna grab one for a size comparison. But so far, whoever got this for 80 bucks, I double checked. <laughs> this is a great deal because it's LPH. Usually LPHs are up there in like the 300, $400 range. But instead, I got this one for 80 bucks. But again, from Japan. So I guess it was from a pawn shop. So they didn't really need it like that. So. Hey, you know, sometimes you go luck out. So that's why I say don't be afraid to scour eBay. And especially for something interesting. I mean, you're gonna have something that you don't see very often. I mean, it all works as Iwata, amazing company. So that's why I always say give things a shot. And I'm excited for this. So this is the unboxing of this. So here's the, so here's the LPH 300. And a 101 very similar but i'm starting to look at it now and i think the caps looks close but size wise this is a little smaller it's kind of interesting so i don't know i'm gonna try to see real quick if the caps fit i know it sounds horrible idea for some people but i'm gonna try it and it fits if i'm not sure how it's gonna spray but it fits, so hey, um, you know, I'm not gonna fight it. Here's my sidekick. <laughs> She's about to go outside and play with her little vest on. But yeah, for the LPH 101, and so the two caps, almost identical. I kind of like that. So I guess if anyone like me ever loses or breaks something, there's a chance to replace it. Um, but yeah, this is a good idea. Okay, so unbox them. Another eBay find. 
quick little $80 eBay find and that was with um, shipping covered. So I like to always find things with shipping covered. And for $80, I this is you can't beat this, literally. It's LPH. Anyone that knows LPHs are amazing for Iwata. And oh, let me put these caps back on. <laughs> but yeah, I just wanna say like, share, comment, subscribe. And any questions you ever have, I always say, hey, you know, ask away or anything you just, you know, anything else you know about it, hey, let me know. I love the LPHs and now I'm gonna start trying to look more into like the one-on-one -on -one series because this is pretty light. I mean, eh, you gotta add the paint in it, but so far it's pretty light, I would say for the size of it. And it's interesting, I mean, you know, being addicted to paint guns and the idea of trying new guns, hey, I'm always up to trying something new. So, so I just wanna say, have fun, enjoy it. You know, don't be afraid to get anything different or anything out of your element, because you never know it might be more worth it. So stay tuned for part two, where I'm gonna shoot the uh, LPH 100, just to get an idea. I might compare it to a W 400 or the LPH 300, and it might compare the fan pattern to different size guns. I wanna say this might be in the mid gun range. I don't wanna say mini gun, because I know this is more like a compact, so I guess it's a compact range because size wise. But hey, you never know. It might impress us. So stay tuned and see you soon. Thanks for watching.